And now to a sad story out of Southeast Portland. A tree fell onto a motor home in Southeast Portland, causing it to go up in flames, killing a 40 year old mother. And tonight we're hearing from her family and friends. Joyce O'Gary live to tell us how they're dealing with everything. Joyce, just proof that this has just been a deadly Arctic blast we had. Jeff and Liz, she was a mother of seven children. Her friends and family are still in shock tonight after this tragedy. We come to see you, visit with Stephanie. Yeah, she was a good friend. Today was the first time Stephanie Turvey's loved ones could return to the motorhome on Southeast 105th Avenue after this week's severe storm. They put up a memorial in her honor. Bill Nelson lived in the motorhome and was letting his friend Stephanie stay there. Bill was there when the tree fell. The wind just picked this RV up, spun it around and dropped it. Bill was able to get out with two other people. He tells us a tree fell on top of his motorhome. Then he believes a propane tank exploded, but Stephanie still stuck inside. I was coming running out to the front. I turned around, I looked, and there was fire on top. So then I had to go back in and make sure that it wasn't easier to get out that way. Right away, he tried to save her. The windows were still intact. And between the kicking and pulling, I only got one. And then the second one pulled it off. I still couldn't get to her. She was pinned underneath the tree. When fire crews arrived, they found a tree on the RV as well as a power pole with multiple live lines and a transformer. Nobody got shocked here. You know, there was quite a bit of lines all the way down. Down lines making it hard for firefighters to attack the fire. Investigators say an open flame stove was being used when the tree fell, causing the RV to catch fire. And it's really sad that this happened. Stephanie's cousin Autumn tells us the 40-year-old just turned her life around before her life was cut short. She was a good person. She was very loving, you know, and we all have struggles and we all have issues in life. And she was bettering herself and to be the mom that she wanted to be just to lose her like that you know it was sudden and nobody expected it stephanie's family set up a gofundme page we had that information at coin.com live in southeast portland joyce o'geary coin six news just such a sad and tragic story